it's a shed for life program like we were doing our activities and we were doing things but we were trying to broaden kind of what men were getting out of the shed as well so this uh, sheds for life program has dovetailed very well into what we were doing already it's uh, addressing the issues that we need to address you know it kind of focused people on where they're at with their health and well-being we collaboratively work with the men to find out what their needs are, what their interests are and what way they find is the best way to approach men's health in the men's shed setting. Finding a way to deliver a programme on the men's own terms and where they feel most comfortable is really, really key to Sheds for Life. We're proving that men can do health, it's just the approach that you take is so important. We have been threatening to do walking with maybe two years, but it never really took place but like if there's someone coming in on a special day it will, will and once we start then we will keep it going. Three weeks ago, one to I was in the hospital with the to walk and, and all this. I'm walking now. I was in a bad way. I'm telling you only for the shed I'd be a different person. It's great and it's great for the camaraderie that brings us closer again. It's, it's doing things together. It's fantastic. And it does make us more aware uh, as we're getting older, uh, of, of you know, we need to go and get our blood tested every year and all this sort of stuff. So yeah, very informative, excellent, uh, totally enjoyable. The, 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 the lady that was, was holding the, the meeting, she was brilliant. All the men we've met have a wealth of information themselves. The collaboration has been great, it's the interaction has been really good and it's a very adaptable and easy to understand programme that the awareness has been um, changed or increased with different elements of healthy food and health, healthy eating for the men and for myself too and it's been great fun, it's really enjoyable. Men, like, they don't speak uh, face to face, they speak shoulder to shoulder and fellas have become more aware of their, of the, um, of their health and they're not as shy about coming forward and saying look I have prostrate trouble, I have this, I have that, do you know what? It's, it's after it's after putting a kind of a new uh, a new slant on people about their health and health awareness.